I got this battery secondhand. Someone scammed me. I was trading a tool and they offered a battery in exchange and it was better as after, but when I got the battery, it had an issue with it. But I figured out what the issue is and how to fix it. So here's what I worked out. Uh, I've got my multimeter there on DC. Put the probes in. And there should be voltage here, but there's not. When I press just here, I get voltage. This pin here connects to the thermistor, which is how the charger or the tool uh, detects whether the battery is overheating. Um, I noticed you, pl you plug a torch into it, it works fine. Plug a charger into it or a, a battery tool, or like a power tool. The light on the tool will light up, but the tool won't go at all. Uh, I guess this is how it behaves when it thinks the battery is overheated or when it can't get a signal so it doesn't know if the battery is overheating. I figured out the problem because when I had it on the charger, if I pushed really hard on the heat of it, I managed to charge it by putting a weight on it, um, it would go. And then I took ages figuring out. I eventually put my multimeter across all the pins until I found a pin that was behaving differently from one of my other batteries. And then I found this. So the way I'm going to try to fix it is I'm going to try to pile something up so that when I put this cover on, it squashes it. So obviously there's just a loose connection somewhere in this board or under this board and a little bit of pressure brings the connection back. Just looking at it, it looks like this bit here is where I need to get my pressure in because it's just that spot there. All right, this is gonna be my first attempt. I've got this soft bit of rubber, at, give a bit of cushion and a washer. I'm hoping this washer spans the gap of that hole and we get pressure. That didn't work, it was, it was too thick. I couldn't get this thing on. So I'm gonna try just the washer and see if I can get this to go. Okay, one washer didn't give us enough pressure. I'm gonna try two. Okay, that fixed it, it's going now, but I have to open it up again to put this bit in. And there we go, it's all fixed and back together again. Um, pretty confident it's gonna keep working since I worked out what was causing the fault. Uh, and I got it working last time, uh, but I didn't know what, <laughs> what I did to make it go, so I'm not surprised it failed again.